What's going on guys? Chris Lopez here with Jersey Beast TV. In this video, we're going to talk about how you can properly execute the dumbbell row. Now the dumbbell row is a great mass builder and strength builder for your upper back. Um, however, every time you see guys doing it in the gym, 99.9% .9 of the time, it's wrong. They're doing it wrong, their foot position's wrong, they're, they're pulling the weight improperly. So let's go through some of the mistakes that a lot of guys make, how we can correct them so that you'll be well on your way to increase the weight and build that solid V taper that everybody wants. All right. So first things first, you pick your weight. Obviously you have your program and your rep range set up. Put one knee on the bench. You're gonna put one hand on the bench. All right, either on the side or flat. Um, depending on the bench, it will depend on where my hand position goes. This one's got a crease because it's adjustable bench, so I just put my hand right on top like that. It works perfect. Now the first mistake I see most guys do is their foot is too close to the bench. They put their foot directly close, right next to the bench, you know, maybe like a six or eight inch gap, 10 inch gap uh, from between their knee and the bench, which is okay, but there's a more effective way to do this to handle more weight. Um, what you wanna do is kick that leg out, right? Kick the leg away from the bench and back a little bit. And what that's gonna do, it's gonna give you like a, like a tripod, your hand, your knee, and your foot. So now you can handle more weight because the weight hangs in between the hand and your foot straight down. If that foot is here and you have, and you went from a 50 to a 90 pound dumbbell, that weight's gonna pull you to the floor. Now your leg is engaged and your core is engaged and you're taking less of the focus off your back. So you kick that leg out nice and wide, bend the knee a little bit, get in a good, sturdy, stable position, give yourself a good base. You're gonna pick the dumbbell up and the mistake I see most guys, there's two mistakes I see most guys do when they row. Number one is they row turning at the hips and shoulders. They open the hips and they take the shoulders uh, from being square and they open the shoulders up. No good. Because now you're using your legs and your hips and you're taking the focus off your back. You want your back to be the main focus of this lift, all right? So instead, keep the shoulders square and you're pulling the dumbbell straight up, just using the lats and the rear delts, pulling the dumbbell straight up. You pull the front head of the dumbbell to your armpit, all right? The second mistake I see most guys do when they pull the weight up is they pull the dumbbell straight up, flaring the elbow out this way. The elbow should go back along your body, keep it tight, pull it back, and that's gonna put the front head of the dumbbell in the proper position you get the maximum uh, tension in your upper back. All right, if you flare the elbow out, you're gonna hit the rear delt, you're not really gonna feel it in your back. So just to show you how this is done, tripod, one, two, three, keep that leg out, grab the weight nice and square, and pull. And if you notice, because my leg is kicked out and back, almost behind me a little bit, the weight doesn't interfere. If you have your knee closer to the bench and you go to pull that weight up, you're gonna, you're gonna hit your leg and then you have to adjust your body as you're rowing so that you don't hit your leg and now you're not focused on squeezing your back. But that's a dumbbell row. Another quick tip for you guys, instead of picking the weight up and plopping it to the other side of the bench, which I see a lot of guys do, you just spin around, you hit that second set, on the other side, real easy. Just spin, and you go right to town on that second step, no breaks. I see a lot of guys pick the weight up, pick it up, they do this, they hobble over to the other side of the bench, they put it down, fuck that shit. <laughs> Just spin around the bench. All right guys, but that's the dumbbell row. If you're interested in more free training tips, nutrition hacks, supplement secrets on how to maximize your time in the gym with no BS. Uh, subscribe to my free newsletter for men. Um, it's my way of just giving back and helping you guys not struggle with the same things that I used to struggle with for the last almost 20 years of doing this. All right, guys, I'll post up the link to the newsletter in the comment section and the description. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We'll talk soon.